If one looks at the RMA practices together and the expertise that one gets within all of the RMA practices, it really represents a tremendous amount of knowledge, a tremendous amount of science, and actually represents more IVF cycles than any other single practice or single entity. We wanted to be able to offer the best laboratory facility and the best services available to our patients. And so in building this facility, we involve the leaders in the field in order to be able to build the most cutting edge laboratory to offer our patients truly the best, the most modern technology available. The facilities are able to offer all of the technology that's out there today and was designed in such a way to be able to continue to grow as the technology continues to develop so that we are always able to offer our patients the best, the newest, whatever is available to maximize their likelihood of going home with a baby. Uh, safety is our number one concern. Every time we handle uh, eggs, embryos, sperm, we uh, double and triple check the identity of each specimen. Uh, we have one embryologist, the primary embryologist, who will do the procedure, but we have a second embryologist who is available to confirm the identity of e the tube of sperm, the dish of embryos, the dish of eggs. Everything is double checked by the patient name, patient identifying number, uh, at least twice. Obviously, a laboratory is a structure. It's a great structure. It has all sorts of wonderful things to make pregnancy rates the highest, but it, it is just a structure. And so what makes us who we are, what makes our pregnancy rates as good as they are, is obviously the laboratory that we have with you know, terrific air handling, wonderful incubators, microscopes, hoods, all sorts of fancy stuff. But also, obviously, extraordinarily important are the team of people that we bring to the table to be able to provide these services to our patients.